Hello. Our kids are sick. Yep. We're Still. going to make our flight amazing. Um, it's been sick, what, three days-ish? Since Wednesday. And today is Saturday. Yes. Good times. days until we leave. We leave on Tuesday. So today they are sitting inside with the thingy. Came in a fire. Yeah that. Yes. <laughs> and saline spray in the nose and basically all that fun stuff. So yeah. Hopefully they're better by Tuesday. Hopefully. Last night we reserved our car service. To bring us to JFK. Yeah. And um, they're, I know it is really bright. They're gonna pick us up at 7 a.m. <sighs> Our flight leaves at 12.30. I thought it was 12. It boards at 12, but it leaves uh, at 12.30. Makes sense. Um, but I, I think it's going to take like an hour for us to get there, plus traffic. Because it's like rush hour. And we have a lot of stuff, so we have to check two bags. I thought it was more than that. No, I think we're just checking two. Well, we check my bag, your big blue bag. Uh, are we checking Aubrey's Hello Kitty suitcase? We can, but it's not necessary. I think we should because it's going to be hard to carry everything and board while dealing with the two strollers. Okay, so we have three bags to check. And then we have to make it through security with our six. La no, four laptops. No, I'm putting, well, we'll have your laptop, my main laptop. Two little laptops. No, one little laptop. Okay, and, and then, then the rest is going on, luggage. well, in my bag that's getting checked. Okay, and then we have two Kindles. Two I don't phones. think we have to take that, them out, though. Really? I was reading, and it's something like, if it's 11 inches or less, you can leave it in your bag. Okay, so our phones and our Kindles and the camera stay? Yeah. So that's not too bad. But we have the two car seats that turn into strollers. What are they called? Uh, sit and stroll? Sit in the stroll. We have two sit and strolls. What are they called, I think? That literally turn from car seat straight into stroller. Wheels pop out of the bottom and a handle comes out of the back. Um, and the kids aren't allowed to sit in them through security. So we have to take both kids out, push the stroller through, put the kids Wait, through. No. Yeah. Can we push it through or do we have to put it through the x-ray thing? No, I think we're allowed to push it through the metal detector. But, but it's it, metal, so that's not really useful. I don't know. All I know is they're not allowed to sit in it. I hope they let us through with it. They it's have to. to it's, it's airport approved. I don't know how that works. But either way, we have to take the kids out of the car seats and then put them back in. And then probably do the same when we get to the gate. But I want to feed them. I want them to run around. I want them to go to the bathroom. So we're budgeting for like four hours of in airport time pretty much. But I don't think it's too much because really they're going to be excited. They're going to need to run around. And then by 12 o'clock, nap time. Nap time, hopefully. Although, with sick children and uh, the pressure in their ears from the flight, I don't know if they're really going to sleep. But we bought them earplugs, which are supposed to help. They're called earplanes. Earplanes? It's supposed to help with the 
the pressure and specifically for the flight. Right, and we're also bringing like snacks and stuff so the chewing helps. Um, and we also have Aubrey's headphones. And we have medicine, like pain relief in case of extreme emergency. Starbucks. Starbucks. It's so beautiful. <laughs> We're at um, a little bit Starbucks addicted. Just a little bit. A little bit. Our gold card currently extends all the way to 2018. <laughs> um, but yeah. I drink, this is a caramel macchiato, but it doesn't have the drizzle. And they put caramel syrup in mine, because it's actually a vanilla base, and then it's soy milk. And he gets a caramel latte with soy milk, decaf, because he's lame. Now we're walking home because Chevy has work. We're just running out, because it is a beautiful 62 degrees in New York today. Going to miss this weather. We're vegan, everybody, like all four of us. And so while we're traveling, I mean, the Philippines is pretty vegan friendly. Sort of. Sort of. Um, but we've got our own snacks that we've packed for the flight. We also were made aware that we get to choose a vegetarian meal for our flight which apparently consists of like rice and veggies um and then when we get into Makati we found a hummus place but we'll post the link that we're gonna be ordering from they're open till 3 a.m. and we land at 8 55 p.m. their time so that should leave us plenty of time to figure out what we're gonna eat, what we're gonna feed the kids, get settled. I don't know if we're actually going to be hungry though. I know, I'm not sure about that, but I'm glad that we made the preparations in case anybody is hungry. I think I'm gonna be like, too scatterbrained. Well, it's going to be weird because of the time zone difference. Right. And because... eating on the plane at weird times and napping in between those meals. Right, so. Either way, we've made preparations, and being vegan really isn't that hard. People try to think that um, it's really difficult, but our kids eat mostly like whole natural foods, and they're really healthy. Um, for the two of us, I have- I eat all the things. <laughs> I have hypothyroidism, so that makes everything really hard for me like weight wise but I also grew up in like a, a really rough situation so I have my own um, bad food habits but we are as a family 100% vegan. Aubrey's asleep. <laughs> Oliver's not. And it is 11 11 p.m. And I didn't do much today. Um, trying out a different video editing software. Oliver's handing us a receipt. Thank you. Is he in my wallet? Uh, yes he is. Alright, we're gonna take this. Thank you. Dada. You have your Kindle? Dada. Kindle. Thank you. Very wide awake. So yeah, we're gonna hang out here with him. And tomorrow we're going to the pumpkin patch. Yeah, so I'm not going to be there because I'm working. Uh, I'll be here. I'll bring the camera. And maybe we'll get some cute pumpkin footage. Right? Are you excited about pumpkins? Hmm? Puppy excited? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, we're gonna...
probably go walk him to sleep and then go to bed. Mm -hmm. I don't want to walk. My hair is going kind of crazy at the moment. Nighty-night! Oliver is still awake. It's 12.02 and my mother-in-law is making pancakes. So, I mean, yay for pancakes. We're not walking him. And I'm making ramen because I'm hungry. So, that's it. See you tomorrow.